next question Ramin from Azerbaijan he asks if Allah knows someone will go to hell then why did he create that person Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the glorious Quran in Surah Hazab chapter number 33 verse number 72 إِنَّا عَرَضْنَا الْأَمَانَةَ عَلَى السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضِ وَالْجِبَالِ فَأَبَيْنَ أَنْ يَحْمِلْنَهَا وَأَشْفَقْنَ مِنْهَا وَحَمَلَهَا الْإِنسَانِ That when we wanted to entrust or give the covenant to the heavens, to the earth and to the mountains but they did not take up this trust or covenant because they were afraid of it but man took it we human beings we took this trust we took this covenant we decided to take this test allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he has given us human beings a free will and the purpose of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala creating us human beings it is for ibadah it is to worship allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Surah Dhariya, chapter number 51, verse number 56, وَمَا خَلَقْتُ الْجِنَّ وَالْإِنسَ إِلَّا لِيَعْبُدُونَ That I have not created the jinn and mankind except to worship me. We have been created by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so that we worship Him. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Surah Mulk, chapter number 67, verse number 2, أَلَّذِي خَلَقَ الْمَوْتَ وَالْحَيَاةَ لِيَبْلُوَكُمْ أَيُّكُمْ أَحْسَنُ عَمَلًا It is Allah who has created death and life to test which of you are good deeds. This life is a test for the hereafter. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He created the angels. They do not have a free will. But we human beings, we are a unique creation. We have a free will. And I would like to give you a simple example. For example, there is a person who has done bachelors in English. Now this person, he appears for an examination. And if in the examination he is asked, a, B, C, D or simple things in English. So there is no point in the test. There is no point in the examination. He has done bachelors in English. He needs to be asked something of his level. Similarly, when a college, when a university plans to conduct an examination of MBBS for example. So this examination, it is difficult. The university, the college knows that certain students will fail. But yet the college conducts the examination to test the students, to know which students have worked hard. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He has created us human beings. He has given us a free will. And all those people who do good, they will be rewarded, they will enter paradise. And if someone does wrong, he will be punished for those wrong acts. We human beings, we have a free will. If we do good, we will be better than the angels. Because after Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has given us a free will, we have the option of either doing right or doing wrong. We choose to do the right things. So we will be rewarded from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. 